When you think of safe spaces for kids, a pool hall may not necessarily be the first place that would come to mind. No, but one woman in the Four Corners is trying to change that. Our Meg Kelly shows us a new pool hall that is scoring big with the kids. If you ask Diane Mason who this pool hall is for, she'll tell you. The kids. My kids, all these kids. After 10 years working as an EMT, Mason says she wanted to fulfill a childhood dream. I decided I've always wanted to open up a pool hall since I was 14. Opening Lucky Break just last week, Mason says the non-smoking, non-alcohol pool hall is for getting kids. I'm interested, um, get them all together, get them to socialize in, a, in an atmosphere that's fun as well as a chance for them to grow. What's neat about it is that they're learning life skills. They're learning how to socialize. You know, they're, they're learning the math. When they play darts, they got to do math. And with the pool, they're learning angles. And so far, many teens say they're loving it. There's a lot of gangs, a lot of drugs and everything in the streets. Um, it's uh, really important for uh, kids to have a place that's safe and a uh, good environment to just have fun and spend some time. For 10 bucks a player, Mason says she plans to start holding tournaments on Mondays for both pool and darts. Everything that they can do with, inside this pool hall will help them with life skills. Reporting in Farmington, Meg Hilling, KOBI Witness News 4.